I used to suffer from tremendous anxiety when I was younger. I felt as though I was crazy. You know, this was before the internet, so I had zero information to help me. Then I decided to become a therapist in my mid-20s. And in graduate school, in my, in my mid-20s, I learned about anxiety. And almost immediately, my anxiety went away, for the most part. My anxiety was cured because I knew what anxiety was. So today, for those of you out there who are suffering from anxiety, I want to present information to you so that you can beat your anxiety. And I'll also provide ways, specifically, things you can do to beat anxiety. I also want everyone listening out there to learn more about anxiety so they won't stigmatize anxiety because people with anxiety often feel stigmatized and ashamed, which is, you know, truly a tragedy. This is the Psychology in Seattle podcast. I am your host, Dr. Kirk Honda. I am a therapist and I'm also chair of the Couple and Family Therapy Program, Couple and Family Therapy Program at Antioch University, Seattle. The reason why I'm talking about this today is because I received an email from patron Zoe. She actually sent me an email a few months back, but she also sent me an email recently as well, asking, let's see what she said here. Patron Zoe said, "Uh, I listen to your podcast on YouTube. I have some suggestions for a topic, Uh, hypochondria or agoraphobia panic disorder. She says, this is my favorite podcast, and she spells favorite in the with the U, so either she's Canadian or British or something. But anyway, listener Zoe, this or uh, patron Zoe, this podcast is for you since you've been asking for this for a while, and you're also a, a patron. So patron Zoe wanted me to talk about agoraphobia, and maybe I'll do another episode on hypochondria as well. But but really, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk specifically about agoraphobia for a little bit. But really, when I get into talking about ways to beat anxiety, it applies to everything. It it, it helps with health anxiety or hy- hypochondriasis. It helps with agoraphobia. It helps with panic. All, all the the ways that I'm gonna present later are really ways to to help with any anxiety. Hey, deserving listeners, this is an old episode that we have re-released as a patron-exclusive episode. So if you want to hear the full episode, you have to become a patron of the podcast by going to patreon.com. Patrons get access to all the premium episodes on the Patreon page and on their phone podcast application, or app as they call them. (laughs) When you become a patron, we'll let you know how to access the premium feed on your phone.